Good day, everyone. I'm meteorologist Adam Kolpak. At this time, we've got a few showers that are diminishing, mainly along and east of the Cascades. We're on the backside of an upper level low that's spinning around the state of Idaho here. You can see those showers spinning around. This upper level low will continue to move away along with the cooler temperatures. And we're going to replace it with some pretty hot temperatures coming up for the Rogue Valley. It looks like the warmest temperatures so far this season, or at least for the year, I should say. The hot weather is going to be moving in from the south, and we'll be dealing with hot temperatures not only Tuesday, but also Wednesday. Most of the work week, we may see some moisture, though, sneak in during the day on Wednesday, during the afternoon and evening hours, for a possibility for some scattered showers and thunderstorms. Our pinpoint forecast here shows... Those scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms uh, diminishing this evening. And then overnight tonight, there's going to be some areas of low clouds and fog filling in, especially for the coastal areas. We get pretty hot during the day on Tuesday. I expect highs generally in the 90s here in the Rogue Valley. It'll still be hot also on Wednesday. The difference is we're going to have some moisture moving in from an upper level low, and that means there's going to be a chance for some scattered showers and possibly some thunderstorms Wednesday afternoon into the evening hours. Our forecast for the coast, we'll see some low clouds and fog filling in overnight tonight into tomorrow morning. More sunshine trying to break out during the day with temperatures generally in the 60s and possibly 70s for highs moving inland. This evening, there could be a few remaining rain showers and maybe an isolated thunderstorm. Otherwise, mostly clear to partly cloudy skies overnight with lows from the 40s through the 50s. Highs tomorrow, well, it'll be hot. We have temperatures in the 80s and 90s. I'm going for the warmest day of the year so far in Medford at 95, 58 for low. The record is 101. Set back in 1946 for Medford, 5291 for you, Wairika. East of the Cascades, any scattered showers or possible thunderstorms diminishing this evening. Mostly sunny tomorrow. An isolated late day shower is possible, 43 and 67 for Crater Lake, 4277 Lakeview, 4180 for you, Alturas. First day of summer is this Thursday. And that chance, again, for some scattered showers, thunderstorms, Wednesday afternoon to the evening hours. Your highs on the hot side, generally 90s. Lows will be in the 50s and 60s. Into the weekend right now, I have sunshine mixing in with clouds. Klamath Basin, scattered showers, possibly a thunderstorm, Wednesday afternoon to the evening hours. Your highs generally in the 80s, and lows will be in the 40s and 50s. For Mount Shasta City. Highs will be in the 80s and possibly some 90s. Scattered showers and possibly some thunderstorms Wednesday afternoon into the evening hours. Your lows from the upper 40s right through the 50s. And for the coast, we have cool starts in the upper 40s through the 50s. Again, there could be some late night morning areas of low clouds, possibly some fog. More sunshine expected, though, mixing in at least with the clouds during the day. And summer begins again on Thursday.